Greetings, Internet! This is ozzy 840 and welcome back to Let's Play Denmark. Okay, first a disclaimer. This video has not been recorded at the same time as most of the rest of the ones for the contest, because I'm a lazy bastard and decided to put it off for several months. I'm serious. I'm pretty sure I recorded those in October, and now it's February. So, oops, sorry, whatever. Gear up to get over it. Um, anyway, um, welcome back to the fifth... No, not the fifth. The sixth place entry, uh, contest entry for the, um, not the latest contest anymore. <laughs> God. <laughs> Rage contest number 10. Yokai exterminator exterminations. I, I think I said that right. Um, yeah, we, you already know the spiel already. Any case, um, the fifth place entry, as I mentioned, sixth place entry, as I mentioned, was s the entries, okay, this one is going to consist of a double feature with uh, my video, my my entry, and Q's entry, or Victini, or however you want to call them. Um, <clears throat> because the difference in points was by 0 .02, uh, I'm pretty sure that constitutes enough of the tie, so I'm going to put them in the same video as both the sixth place entry. Okay, I said it right. Well, without further talking, let's get right in because I know I do that. I do too much talking in the beginning. Anyway, this one is of Sakuya. Finally, not Raybu. Thank God. Coincidentally, yeah. coincidentally, actually, both of our entries were of Sakuya, and they scored so similarly. Kind of weird. Anyway, this is like a less evil version of the fucking non-skull from uh, Bonnie Scrubbing. By the boss, and then no, oh, that's pretty cool. Night pattern, like the time's up there. And... Yep, oh, that was dumb. Don't care, made art dis disorientate. Aha, I eliminated all of them to my death. Uh -huh. Brilliant. Oh, shoot, I forgot to get the crap off there. Oh, well, I have to deal with it. Well, that was getting me. Perhaps they shouldn't have played hard mode. No, no, this is definitely. Not like, like uh, volcano style. Oh wait! Oh, oh oh yeah, that's cool with reversing time. Even though know, I'm pretty sure it's not gonna manage. Yeah. But guess what? They curve. Oh, I'm out of lives. Fuck. Oh wait, I can continue it. Aha! There's my gripe with that. I could not do anything to stop that. In fact, I'm not even sure I could bomb. Vibes can back up into you, which is. Um, kind of stupid, especially if they go off screen, you kind of forgot where they were. You can kind of get around that by a... What the? <laughs> I can't move! I'm serious, I can't move! <laughs> I'm stuck going down! Oh, this is brilliant. Oh, goody. <laughs> the hell is wrong with my game? Oh my god. Alright, I'm... Uh be right back. Okay, I don't know what happened before. That was really dumb. Apparently it was a glitch with my computer or something. But anyway, here, if you enter any of those tiny little, um, not really tiny, those huge private squares, they all shoot knives everywhere, and as far as I can tell, it's pretty much impossible to avoid get that thing that happen, especially when you spawn like that in it. Neat concept, though, and I do like it, but, oh. Well, thank God the one that you entered doesn't yeah, I'm pretty sure it's impossible when you look at that. They overlap really nicely. So I guess you just have to deal with the knives that come out. I don't know if I like that. Maybe on normal it's easy. It's not that good. And that explosion effect does you really Max actually that I can't remember if I've shown that in many of my videos before. But anyway, um that is that. Uh I enjoyed it. I have that little gripe about the reverse thing the reverse time part, but uh, and um, and uh, you already heard all my complaints, but it is definitely a quality script. So I'll be right back um, for my entry. And welcome back. And let's dive right into my entry, I guess. I don't really have much to say about it other than it is pretty much exactly the same as when it was uh, as a version that was entered in the contest. It just has a slight bug fix on a graphical bug. Hey, I can just play my replay. Nah, I'll just play. I'll just play normally. <clears throat> anyway, you also have a choice of two-player characters, both of which I devised myself, and you can um, 
So, um, shameless self-promotion. I haven't released them yet because they're not quite finished. Yeah, I know. They're, they've been in the works for a while. But still not, finished. not comfortable releasing anything not finished in. Anyway, we begin. I don't really want to implement my own script because that would seem kind of vain. I don't know. So, you can just enjoy it for yourself. I'll just explain how... Jeez! Oh, Goody, I'm, I'm good to see I'm still good at this. I'm taking myself a lot of lives. Good. Anyway, I based this first card off of a um, spell card from Scarlet Weather Rhapsody. You might remember uh, there's a particular spell card where one red knife bounces off the walls really fast, and then after a while, it comes back into uh, attack the opponent. And apparently, I'm rusty. The opponent needs to be blocking at that one time, or it's going to hit and hurt a lot. So I decided to turn it into Dunmaki for him. I think it came out pretty well. Not really much to say about this non spell, the fact that I really liked it when I made it. Though, I'm wondering if I made it too hard now. But, eh, uh, it's hard mode. I think it's fine. There it is. Silver Sign, Silver Bound. Another spell card. Another fighting game spell card, actually, allows that one. <laughs> Another fighting game spell card, actually, based off of a card by the same name. It's much more simple than the first one, and to be honest, it's probably my least favorite of the, of the spells I made. I was under a lot of time pressure for this one because I, because I just was super procrastinating. Jeez. Can I not be stupid on any of these? And this non-spell came out pretty nice. I'm happy to say that all the non-spells are pretty diverse. One of the judges praised this one for being for looking like it's gonna wall, but surprisingly doing a very good job of not walling. Huh. Okay, I'm gonna have to start anyway. Mastery of time and space is the <laughs> that name is so cheesy. I made it up because I was literally out of time to think of like, eh, what's this what's this bell card day for Sakri? Um Mastery of Time and Space. Here, why not? <laughs> anyway, I took a little bit of a inspiration from the uh, UK's All oh, All Stars, uh, I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with, with how the knives spawn around you like that. And I also and then I added the purple knives and the green two knives on the side, and I, I, I was under a lot of time pressure, but it still came out really nicely. And then there's that explosion effect I love so much. Designed uh, based around the magical singular day explosion effect. And yeah, that's that. Um, I can't really judge my own script, I don't think, so why don't you tell me if you liked it or not in the comments below. Like, subscribe, and while you're at it. <laughs> or really, only if you want to. Anyway, that's that. Have a good day. I'll see you next time. I promise it will be sooner. Yeah, I think I can promise that. It's such a long time.